Hey! Have you developed a chat application by yourself? And, are you looking to host it for free? So that you can use it to talk with your friends? Then, you are going to see the easiest way to do so, in next few minutes. In this video, I shall show you how to host my own developed chat application in cloud server, for everyone's use. If you want to learn, how to develop an online chat application in 10 minutes, please check my previous video of this series. This hosting method you can use, to host any application with any technology. Without any more delay let's start. First, let me show you that I have developed a simple chat application. I have used Node.js Socket.io library. The Node server is running in port 3000. And the chat.html page is the UI for the application. Both of the files download link, you will get in video description. Let me start the server. And now if I go to localhost, at 3000 port, I shall get to see the chat application UI. Also, you can notice the messages in server console, right? Now we shall host it in a live server. To host our application for free, we shall use Heroku Cloud Platform. As you can notice, I am now at heroku.com. You can see the option to sign up for free. I have already an account, so I shall log in. Once you will log in, you will get to see the dashboard like this. As it is showing, I currently have no app deployed. So just click on, create new app. Provide an app name. Let's say Codeboard Chat App. It's showing me that, the app name is available. Select a server region from dropdown. And click create app. And our app is created. We are now inside app dashboard. You will get option to deploy your app from Heroku Git, GitHub and Container Registry. I am going to use the Heroku Git, because it is pretty straightforward. Also very easy to understand. Before going into the deployment process, let me request you all, please subscribe to my channel Codeboard. Your subscription, like, comments, and share motivates me, to create many such useful videos for all of you. Now, first you have to install Heroku CLI in your system, from this link. If you open the link, you will get to see the option, to download the CLI for Mac, Windows, and Ubuntu. You can just download from here as per your operating system, and install. In my system it is already installed, so I am not going to install it again. But the installation process is pretty simple, and similar to any other software installation. After install, you can check your installation, running the command, Heroku-V you will get to see the installed Heroku CLI version. Next, you have to log in via Heroku CLI. So just type, Heroku login. It will ask you to open your browser. Just log in via browser web UI. Once you will log in successfully, you can go back to your CLI, and you will get to see your login confirmation. Now, let me show you that I have copied the package.json file, in my project folder for the required node libraries. Apart from that, I have to create another file here, called proc file. Inside the file I have to write the command, to start the app. For us, the command will be, node, then server.js. Right? Okay. We are now completely ready for deployment, let's expand the command prompt. Make sure that, your command prompt is pointing to your project directory. Now just type git in it. Then, Heroku git colon remote, hyphen a. And then codeboard chat app. You can see, the remote git repository is mapped now. In the command I used my application name. You will get all these commands from Heroku web page. Now, let's just follow the instructions from here. So enter git add dot. Which means, we are adding all files for staging in git. Now let's commit this with our own message.
All our four files are committed now. And finally let's push the code to remote repository. And soon you will notice that, application build is started. You can see, it's showing Node.js app detected. At the end of the build, you can see, your app URL. Let's go to the URL. Ok, just I have to add slash chat. And yes, our app is deployed in a public URL. Now to test it, I asked one of my friends to check the URL. I am going to show you, our quick chat. You can notice, we are able chat seamlessly. There are a lot of scope of improvements definitely. In my next video, I shall improve the UI and add few more functionalities. So please subscribe to channel code board, and click the notification bell icon, to get update about upcoming videos earliest. Also please don't forget to like, share and mention your valuable feedback in comment section. Bye for now.